It is 6.43 now, and a groundbreaking back surgery is uh, being done this morning in Memphis, putting the city on the map for all the world to see when it comes to robotic back fusion. Fox 13's Amy Sparopoulos was allowed to see this famous robot in question and sat down with one of the two neurosurgeons to do the procedure uh, here this morning. And Amy, this is uh, incredible news. It is incredible news. And, you know, I heard you talk earlier about having back issues. And, you know, it really is so very common. Uh, and it can be truly debilitating. I tell you what, I uh, put my back out about a year and a half ago, and I really thought I was having a heart attack. I mean, it can be really, really bad. And this is, Ernie, just the news that Memphis needs right now. And it will really put Memphis on the map when it comes to this amazing procedure. It is a uh, robotic. Robotics, uh, you know, robotics has been around for um, about five to seven years, but this particular uh, robotic fusion back surgery has just become really mainstream within the last year. And Bobby Gallimore is the patient. He is from Union City, Tennessee. He's an Army veteran and father of four who served in Vietnam, which is really cool because the neurosurgeon doing this procedure, Dr. Kevin Foley, is one of the, uh, he is also a veteran. He is one of the surgeons in the spotlight and doing the procedure as well. Dr. Kevin Foley of Sims Murphy and the team from Baptist Hospital will be operating using fusion robotics to perform a spinal fusion for the first time in history. Surgical robotics, as I mentioned, is a five to seven year old industry, but it's picked up steam in the past year. This groundbreaking surgery signals the new era of spine surgery. The fusion robotics system that we'll be uh, utilizing on the surgery uh, is a new, uh, first of its kind robotic system. It uses a, a small uh, camera that attaches to the operating room table. The camera is used to track the location of the robot and the surgical tools, and that's how the navigation is carried out. So amazing. Now, I'm told typically the st scar uh, from a back surgery is about like this, but this robotic surgery helps it become like that. We are live this morning. Amy Sparopoulos, Fox 13 News. Uh, not you, Amy, but some of my colleagues have uh, sort of shamed me about my back pain and complaining about it, but it's it's nothing. It's not a laughing matter. It can be debilitating. Yeah, it, it can. Yeah. In fact, no shame in the game, yeah. Ernie. Appreciate that, Amy. Thank you.